It's been eight years since you left us. It feels like yesterday. Life without you has been worthless. How I wish I could turn the hands of time. I would have done things right and you would still be here with us. You don't have to blame yourself. It's not your fault. I know she's in a better place watching over us. It is my fault. Your mother meant the world to me, yet I could not do anything to save her. I miss her so much. I know you miss her. I miss her too. But we are together now. She's happy wherever she is. I know she is with the Lord and they are watching over us. I miss you. I promise, Abigail. I promise I will never neglect you. I will always put you first before anything. You have always done that. And I know that nothing will change it. <sighs> I know you shouldn't have seen me like this, but I couldn't help it. I just miss your mother so much. It's okay. It's fine. Men do cry. But I promise, anytime you feel like crying, I will give you a shoulder to put head. Oh, my princess. I love you. You too. My handsome father, <laughs> the most handsome man in this world. Ah, 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 ah. See you now. See you now. You find, you said, you talk. Oh my God! <laughs> this your shirt is giving. I'm yeah. telling you. You like the shirt? I'm telling you. But I don't want to look like a rich man. You know there's no money now. And all these MCs, they can be very, very annoying. Which rich, rich man? See, let me tell you. Poverty is in the mindset. Because you are broke doesn't mean you don't have money. Or you should not be dressing like poor people. You need to look smart, look good, look good, you know? Yes, so you're looking nice. Figure, are you sure this shirt is okay? I'm very sure now. Have I ever liked you before? I'm sure. You can go like this. It's okay. Okay, but um, come with me now. You know I'll be very bored at this party. No, I would love to come with you, but I need to deliver that Mr. Naka's portrait. Yes. Today is his wife's birthday. And you want to surprise her with the portrait. It's true, it's true, it's true. Take care of that, yeah? Yes, Harry. Don't look for anybody's trouble because I, I know you. Know. Ah. Bye. Bye. Ah, you are looking so good, man. Fine. Yes. Come on, give me a five. Good. I'll yeah. be back. Yeah? I'm bouncing. I'm bouncing. Bye. I'm bouncing. Bye bye. Wow, this is beautiful. Goodness, goodness. You know, my wife is going to love this. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. But that is the best. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, you can say that again. With what I'm seeing, your father is definitely the best in this town. And you know, I can beat my chest and say that your father is the best. Yes, yes. And you know what? I, I I have a friend. I have a friend in Europe. Yes, he wants to. He wants a portrait of his mother on his mother's sister's birthday. 
Yes. Don't worry. I will link you up. I will link your father to him. Really? Oh, yes. Ha. I mean, if that's all I can do, I'm okay with it. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I'll do that. I'll Thank do that. Thank you so much. It's son. okay. Hmm. It's okay. <laughs> yes. Okay, now we'll be going. Rabbi, um, let me wish your wife a happy birthday. I will, I will. Just stop, just a minute. No, don't, don't be in a hurry. Just a second. Let me get you something for your transport. Ah, so I don't worry. Let me go. I can go like that. I insist, I insist. I insist. Okay? I mean, this is this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Thank you, sir. Okay. This is this, this way. Thank you, this sir. This will do. <laughs> Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, let me go to your daddy. Okay, sir. All right. Wow. Goodness. Ignoring you, I didn't hear you. Hey, uh, I've been calling. It's okay. Uh, how may I help you? Uh, you look so fine today, so so handsome. Where are you coming back from? Thank you. I, I went for a party. I'm on my way home now. Yeah. Okay. Eh, uh, Nesta. Yes. What about what we discussed yesterday? See, I really like you. I love you so much. I cannot live my life without you. Mm? Okay. Um, you know what, you know I've told you that uh, you should give me time to think about it. Okay, tomorrow, come to the house. I'm sure by the time you get to the house, I'll give you an answer. Hey. Yes. Okay. And if I'm coming tomorrow, what do you want me to prepare for you? See, I have to prepare a fancy. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> don't stress yourself. Just, just come. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Okay, I'll leave. If you don't mind, let me walk. Um, I, don't, I don't mind though. Yeah. Yeah, I don't mind. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Well, you look uh, so Mary, fine. Thank you. <laughs> See, I really like you. Yeah, you've told me so many times. Hey, I want to tell you again so you know. Okay. Mm. I've heard you. I, I'll, I'll keep hearing you. <laughs> <laughs> Please think about it. Yeah? Yeah. Give us a chance. We won't be waiting. Mary. 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 You're so fine, you know? Thank you. All like you. Hey, I'm sorry. You're fine today. <laughs> 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 I'll take good care of you. Ah. you know, yes, now. Oh, okay. I'll take good care of you so much. Ah. That'll be wonderful though. Yes, so oh. just think about it. Give us a chance. Eh? I'll, I'll, you won't I'll, regret it. I'll think about it. I'll think Please, about it. Please, okay? mm? My love. Alright. Mm? My sweet heart. Okay. My sweet heart. Ah. Yes, I don't want your daughter Swahala. <laughs> yes, I heard she goes about fighting every woman she sees with you. Really? Yes, now. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, thank you for walking me. At least it was not boring having you. Anytime, anything for you. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll see you, yeah? Uh, give me a hug now, okay? I should hug you? Yes. Hey. <laughs> yes, now. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Okay. Don't worry. Ah. Mm. Mm. It's so delicious. You like it, huh? Mm -hmm. You should have seen how your daddy was hustling for food. The woman sharing the food, eh? 
She's very annoying. Do you know she passed my table three times? She will carry food like this and she will pass in front of me. I'll be looking at the food. Ah, what's wrong with this woman? I was so angry. I just got up from my seat. I approached her. I said, Excuse me, why would you pass my table three times without giving me food? This my dad is safe. This my dad is safe. I fall my hand. I fall your hand? Yes, now. Nah. How? You have to package yourself, you know, act rich. If you go there, you know, you're not supposed to go and meet yourself. I should act rich. Mm -hmm. After I just sprayed 1K, only 1,000 I sprayed, though, I should act rich. No, no. If I had acted rich, you think you'd have got it, gotten this food to eat? This food, she wanted to throw it away. Oh. Are you serious? Ah, she was going to throw the food away and I said, excuse me, ma'am, what is that? <laughs> it's my dad. <laughs> You pass my table three times. You want to throw this one away? If you don't like it, give it to me. You can embarrass somebody. Ah! You know how shame this which, my daddy. Which, which shame? When there's no food in the house. Hmm. I should let this one go. Don't worry. Say it. Mm -hmm. you, no, no, no. Nah, just leave it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just leave it. No! Embarrassment food. Leave I got this kind of embarrassment. Oh, you like it? Mm-hmm. I'm not your daughter. You need it for me now. I'm out. Mm-hmm. Why is this meat so small? Hold on, let me take it. <laughs> so you can't do this for me? I have to. Yeah, I did this for you. You can't do this for me. See your mouth. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Well, I think you should have packaged yourself. There's no package. Yeah, just... <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma. <laughs> do that again. Yeah. My princess. I'm sure mommy is watching us from there. Yeah. I'm sure she's smiling down at us right now. I just wish I could see her one more time. Me too. We miss you. That reminds me. Um, I want to ask you something. What is it? What do you think of Mary? I don't understand. I said, what do you think? I mean, what do you think about Mary? Like, Hope he's not what I'm thinking. Relax. The thing is, I think she likes me. And the last time she walked me to the house. I think she's poor. And you don't need poor people in your life. She can't offer you anything, so I don't need that. Money is not everything, Abigail. Money is everything. Especially now you need help. You need someone who can help you get back on your feet. So I don't think she's capable of doing that. You still have not answered my question. What do you think? Well, I think she's poor for you. Please let's enjoy this moment. Okay. We're watching mom in yeah, the moon. Yeah. Let's continue. Yeah, we were. My Look madam. <laughs> my madam. <laughs> But seriously speaking, Abigail, you have to let your father be with another woman. Give him a chance. Because if you ask me, I will say he has tried. It has been eight years since your mother died and he has not remarried. Mm -hmm. Okay, take my father for example. When my mother died, he didn't even take him five months before he remarried. Let him be now. Uh -uh. You don't want to have a mother. That is why you are like this now. Your father is poor. He married a poor girl from his village. How do you think they will move forward? Putaba, you that I know what I'm saying. I know what I'm saying. What are you trying to say? <laughs> I'm not stopping my father from reminding me. The problem there is 
the girls that are coming after you. They are poor. I know that two blind people cannot work together. Who will lead each other? A big girl. Money is not everything. As much as they love each other, they can be together. Who talk? Who talk? I said it. I'm the one that said it. Love plus money is equal to extra love and happiness. They did. If your father, okay, for example, if your father has money, do you think your stepmother will even have the mind to fight your father? Or if your stepmother has money, will your father beat your stepmother? No. It cannot happen. This is they got married every day. My daddy is beating my mom. This are this are this are they are fighting. They are doing this. Calm down. I know what I'm stop, saying. Stop using my father for reference. Uh -uh. See. Calm down. Calm down. Now all of us they here. Calm down. You need to let your father be. A big girl. Let your father be, huh? She cannot think. I don't this. understand you again. Let my father be. Are you the one that wants to marry me? Do you want to marry him? How can I marry him? Then why are you putting him out? Calm down. I'm just shy to be a good friend. Don't be. It's not what you think. You to see. In fact, let me even go straight to the point. You cannot be with my father. You are poor. You are poor. What do you have to offer to him? You cannot be with my father. See, I truly love your father. And I hope you don't regret this. I don't have any problem with you loving my father. I am not against the fact that you love my father. You can love him till you die. Anything. Well, you see. You cannot be with him because you are poor. You cannot even feed yourself. You cannot even take care of yourself. You want to love my father. Madam, be going, I beg. Ah, be going. I'll be leaving you because I don't want problem. Be going. Go in peace. Just tell your father. Left be father. going, auntie. Be going. Uh -uh. Every time, my father, my father, my father. He won't rest for you. What was, what, what was she doing here? Where is she going? What was she doing here? I thought you have my opinion about her. I was going to tell her that there, nothing can go on between us. What did you tell her? The truth. Which truth is that? Abigail! My prince. What's that? Look. Another job? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey. And this one is international. Yeah? Yes, the man lives in Europe. Wow. I wanted to take it to Mr. Naka two days coming. So, you don't need to worry. Hey! We are going global, international. Yes, ma'am. Mr. Dinaka. He's one that connected us to the man, so we need to take it there. He said he liked the portrait you do for the wife. Wow. Hey! So, See, yeah. too fast. My daughter, I don't know what I would do without you. You are so amazing. You see all these jobs that are coming in, the money? I will be saving it because you, you have to finish your work. Mm -hmm. After that, you go to the best university. And buy car for me. But is it? You buy car for me. Car. Wait. Let us let let's. Don't worry. It's all make it proud. There's more money in here. Oh. Yes, ma'am. Ha. Eh? Yeah. 
Mm. This is about say, wait, wait, let, let me count it first. Money! <laughs> Why are you so fast with money? Wait, can you get this one? Just this one. Why? Abigail. Just dash me this now. This, uh, this, this. Wait, just, just bring it first. Let me keep it, eh? I'll put them all together. You see that your box that you keep saving money? I'll put it in there. Give me. You like money. This money, you will not see it. Hi! That's for Dinaka. Eh? Poor daughter. She must be very tired. Mm. Daddy, what are you doing? I thought you were sleeping. Mm -mm. Drop me. Okay, let me just go put Drop it down. Drop me, I'm not the You will sleep. You are going to sleep. Drop me, no, no, no. You don't have to carry me. Drop me. Baby, you are still my baby. No, I'm 15 going to 16. I don't care, you are still my baby. Okay? Now, get some sleep. Okay. Love you. Love you too. Well, I'm sorry I drove my way away. I don't okay. just want you to end up with someone like her. It's okay. I understand. And I promise not to be with any woman you don't approve of. Promise. Promise. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. All right, bye. I miss you, Angela. I miss you so much. Life has not been fair on our side. The future I envisioned for our daughter, she's not getting there. But she's a sweet child. She loves me like you do. <laughs> I promise. I promise to give her a better life. I will continue to work hard to make sure she doesn't suffer anymore. I'll give her a better future. That I promise. <sighs> you mean that 
that little girl chased you away from the house? I am telling you, Mekos. I am telling you. I even tried to let her know how much I love her father, but she wouldn't listen. Wait, though. Is it that she doesn't want the father to be married? His wife died eight years ago, and it's long overdue. I tell you, I tell ya. You didn't need to see how that small rat insults me. She gave it to me hot. Eh? I'm so tired, honestly. Uh, it's okay now. Nah. Be coming down when a small thing don't vex. Eh? Honestly, I have removed my hand. Anything that concerns your friend, I don't want again. I am tired. I don't want to do again. It's okay, fine. I will talk to Nesta. Eh? Nesta is my friend. I know he will listen to me, okay? I will talk to him. I will tell him how much you love him. And I, don't worry, I will do the work. Eh? After talking to him, don't, don't worry, everything will be now fine. Now you savvy that one. No. Me, I cannot take it again. You need to see. That girl, she's so saucy. She's so, she's so saucy. She has the, hey, God. Hey. It's okay. Hey. I heard she goes about embarrassing all the girls she sees with her father. I cannot take it though. Honestly, I, don't I do. can't. I'm sorry. Sorry. I give me a hug. Which hug? Hug me now. I said I will talk to Nesta. Nesta with you. I don't want to again. I'm tired. Yeah. Honestly. So Daddy. Huh? What is it? Where are you going to? I'm going to see Mekos. He wants us to have drinks. Me, I'm bored. I want to go with you. Do you have to ask? Of course you can come. Okay. Let me go and change to something good. I, I, I think just drink so. Ha. Huh. Abigail, hurry up. Meku is already waiting for me. Abigail! Ready. Let's go. So this one that you are wearing and that one you are wearing before, what's the difference? This huh? one is better now. How is this one better? To look good now, is it because I'm going to the back? I'll now look like somebody that that that, that not come from house. So that one, it looks like somebody that does not come from house. Uh -huh. Who do you think are talking to you, this girl? <laughs> you not. <laughs> Hey, Abigail, hmm? order anything you want. Make us pay. <laughs> but I make us what's the budget? <laughs> what's the budget now? I don't understand. Your budget, I will know the things I can pick. So I will know if it's the budget or. Not too expensive, uh, just normal. Small. Uh, small. Small. Yeah, small. <laughs> okay, uh, don't worry, just order anything you, you want, I will pay you. Yeah? Mekus! Uh, oh my, <laughs> <laughs> my god! Oh my god! We are called the name of 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 the very important. Uh, Abigail, I want to discuss something with your father, yeah? We'll be back shortly, okay? Okay, now that you go after you tell me. No, I'll tell you. Uh, just <laughs> make yourself I'll tell you everything. Yeah? Order anything you want. Even, even Boma sauce, they have it. Okay. Yeah? <laughs> Come on, wait. Okay, you are leaving again. Okay, you. Give me meat. People have meat now. Uh, give me meat. Give me. Oh. 
last. I say more too. How much? But you don't have much. No more. Yes. Now is the hand and cheat stuff. Thank you. Nesta, what is wrong with you? Must you go everywhere you're going with your daughter? I don't understand. What is wrong with that? She's my daughter and I can go anywhere I want to go with her. It's not supposed to be so. You are not the only father in this town. Look, I have my two beautiful daughters. Why are they not here with me? It's not everything you're doing, you go along with your daughter. If you want to bat, you go with your daughter. If you want to pull, you go with your daughter. Come on, it's not making sense. You need some privacy as a man. Mekus, I have a special bond with my daughter. You see that girl? She's all I have. She's my best friend and my world. If you don't have a special bond with your daughters, that is your business. <laughs> what? You call that one special bond? Eh? Oga, that is obsession. Are you, you both are... Are, are, are you mad? Of course I'm not mad, but you both are obsessed with each other. Because don't let me disrespect you. You're my friend. What do you mean we are both obsessed with each other? How can you even say such a thing? Look, if you brought me here to insult me, let me just get my daughter so that we can go home. I, I, I am not insulting you. For God's sake, I am stating the fact. Eh? You need some privacy as a man. Can we just go in and go and drink? That's why I came here. Okay, fine. Oh, um, oh, wait. Um, how far with Mary? Nesta, that girl loves you so much. You need to see how she was crying the other day. She said your daughter chased her away and since then you've not called her to know how she's doing. Now, nothing can happen between me and that girl. My daughter does not like her. Your daughter doesn't like her? Yes. Nesta, can you listen to yourself? Why? Who is that big girl to dictate to you the woman you should be with? She's my daughter and her opinion matters to me. Are you sure you're a man? Look, I'm going inside to drink. If you like, stand here and talk to yourself. What is wrong with this guy? Ah, my princess! Hey! It's beef. That's good though. Very nice. Mm. Bama, bring more drinks, eh? Let me even taste this. Uh, why are you want this? This is my father and daughter. Wait, now let me test this one first. I don't know. Bama! Bring more meat, more meat, more meat. And bring a beer for my. No, it's not what they do. Or any alcohol. What do you want me to drink? Drink a mineral or oh, drink a little bit. Mineral, this one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no problem now. Minara, she doesn't want me to drink beer now. Let me just drink Minara. I don't want to drink alcohol. Oh, yeah. That's corrupting for me. I don't drink. He can't corrupt me. He can't. <laughs> Who did it? Is it bad for you to drink Minara? No, it's not bad. Bring Fanta for me. Eh? Bring Fanta for me. Mm. I don't want you to be angry. Say Minara. Let me drink Minara. No, no, I'm not telling my father anything. No. I'm not telling him What's anything. I'm, I'm telling him to drink more Minara. What's the corrupt you? Yeah. I said I want to drink milk. Is it by force? Ah, make you order your own now. Bow man, more meat. Let me eat this one. Now my daughter will eat this now. Let me eat. Ah, meat is not the problem. Mm -hmm. Ah, thank you. No, more meat, more meat, more meat. Yeah. Pack all of them. Pack this pack. Bring, bring all the meat to. Oh, oh. How are you? I'm fine. You're here to see your friend, eh? Abigail. 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 Your friend is here to see you. Please come. Ah, Stella! How are you? I'm fine. Come on, sit down. Why no, no, no. I'm in a hurry. Mr. Naka is looking for you. I don't know, I'm, I'm in his mind. 
Research, come now. Yes, now, now. Okay. okay. Hurry up, oh. I'm back. How did it go? How did it go? It went well. Mm, what did Mr. Odinaka say? He said his friend liked the picture and he took your number. Really? Mm hmm. So I expect his call. Oh, okay. You're going out? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to meet uh, Mekus. We have a very important meeting. Me, I'm tired. I cannot go with you. So I want you to stay at home with me. I should stay at home. Ah, Abigail, where we are going is very important to you. Mm. So which one is more important to you? Where you are going or me? Of course it's you. So you are staying at home with me, right? You are my best. My best daddy. And I'm your best. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So... We are at home. See, Let me help uh, you. Uh, uh, no, sit down. Since you don't want me to go out, mm? Mm -hmm. and I'm very, very hungry, you have to go in there and prepare something for us to eat. No, I told you I'm tired. You are tired? Ah, uh, so who's going to make food for us to eat? Mm, you wait small now. If I wake up, we will cook. When you wake up, then we will cook, not you will cook. We. Mm -hmm. yeah. I want to sleep. I always go inside, so you help me and find me. I should find you when you are sleeping. <laughs> Let's go. Let me help you. Don't be only get papa. Oh. <laughs> hey, you know. The food smells nice. Mm -hmm. mm. This food reminds me of your mother's cooking. I'm sure you got your skills from her. Yes, ma'am. My mother was the best cook on earth. Yeah. Uh, who's calling me? Pick it. Maybe it's the client, Mr. of Nakavig, your number two. Uh, true. True. Hello? Yes, uh, Nesta speaking. Okay, I know him. Yes, I, I did that at work. No problem. Just send the address. I'll be there first thing in the morning. Okay. Thank you. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> I want this kind of job to come to you. Steady, steady, steady. Ah, may God bless Mr. Dinaka. Amen. That man is a good man. Good man. So which time will we be leaving tomorrow? First thing in the morning. Just <laughs> hmm. you know. I'll work you if I can. <laughs> <laughs> Soon I will make money now for this type of house. Amen. Amen. See, look, look, just look at the light. It's, it's like flower. Now what? See, the, the, the guy, the, the guy's head is as big as your own. It's not as big as me. Hello. Uh, good morning, ma'am. Don't call me, ma'am. I'm not old. My name is Cindy. Good morning, Cindy. Who's she? Um, she's my, my princess. She's my sweet daughter. Oh, I see. 
You both can have your seat. Thank you. Well, what do I offer you and your daughter? Um, oh, we are fine. Thank you. Okay, then I will go straight to the point. I saw the portrait you did for Mr. Odinaka, and it caught my fancy. I would want you to draw a painting of me. I need it to be very beautiful. I don't know if you understand what I'm talking about. Um, you have nothing to worry about. You're talking to the right person. Good. And um, is this your house or, or your husband's house? This is my house. Wow. Okay. Before I get the sample of what you will be drawing, will you both mind joining me for lunch? Oh, no, no, no. We, we, we are fine. Right, you Abigail? Sure? Yes, right? Yes, we are fine. But yeah. if she insists, <laughs> we will get it. Shall we? <laughs> yes. Okay. Come along. Ah, uh, okay. Sorry, I need to pick this call. Oh, okay. <laughs> She's rich. She's the kind of woman I want you to be attracted to. Will you keep quiet? Wow, now. I want now. This is my Keep thing. quiet. Hmm? What if she hears you now? She will not yet. Your mouth. You like, you can talk. I want you to, to you know, shoot your shot like. I should shoot my shot. Your, look, your charm. Which charm? Have you given me any charm? Make me understand. I want her to be my stepmother. Ha! Huh. Abigail, hmm? you're already thinking that far. <laughs> hey. But it's not bad now. It's, it's bad. Beautiful, right? Yes, she is. And she's rich. Yep. Tell me, do you like her? <laughs> Come on. I just met her, and besides, I am not her type. She is rich, and I am broke. And you are handsome. Okay, so whose type are you? Poor girls. Let me tell you, I don't want poor girls in your life. In Jesus' name! Amen, yes. my prophetess. <laughs> I thought you would kabash all the poor girls. No, <laughs> no, but I don't want them in your life. Okay, thank you. So, when will you draw my own? I want another one. Another picture of you? Mm-hmm. 
Let me just open an exhibition here, eh? so that people come and <laughs> see your pictures. <laughs> no, I yeah. want another one for I'll my birthday. I'll do it for you. I'll do it for you. Mm? I wish I can help you. Hello, Odinakar. I'm sorry for calling you this late. There is something I want to ask you about. The artist. Who is he? There is something about that car I just cannot... I can't just place my hands on it right now. Tell me everything about him. Is he married? Oh, too sad. Oh, I see. You know what? I will come see you tomorrow. Good night. Do have a restful night. <sighs> Nesta, you're very, very annoying. You're very, very annoying. Do you know how many hours they kept him waiting for you? Eh? Only to come and start telling him that your daughter said this, your daughter said that. Can't you say no? I'm sorry now. You know how me and my daughter we are. I just don't want her to be angry. Don't, don't be angry now. No, why huh? wouldn't I be angry? Why wouldn't I be angry? Tell me. Why wouldn't I be angry? Uh, no verse. No verse. Uh, wait, at the come. I'm coming. I'm coming. Wait for you. See, see, see. You see the problem. No, you see the problem. Wait, I'm coming. Hi. Oh. Hey. Hi. Um, what are you doing in this neighborhood? I came to see someone. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Do you live around here? Oh yes, my, my house is not far from this place. I was just driving by and I saw you. Oh. So I thought to say hello. Okay, ah, that's so nice of you. <laughs> I'll give you a call, I have to go now, okay? Um, if you're going to call because of your artwork, it, it will be ready tomorrow, so I'll bring it to you. It's actually not about that. Oh, okay, okay, right. no problem. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. <laughs> That's my client. Your client? Eh, if you see a house, eh? Hey God. If, if they ask you to sit down, you won't sit. <laughs> Mad though. She has money. It's just another thing. Don't let me go there, go do what? I must see Come on, come on. You don't tell me now. Come on, come on. You don't tell me now. Oh, come on, come on, Abby. I will, I will, I will change it no, for you. No, but you won't change them for me. Yes, now. No, you won't make uh, I change them too. Why would you follow me to a house? To do what? Ask what? Calm down now. No, the two first, eh? To do a quick fara. Yes, uh, I am fine, ma'am. Come on, stop calling me, ma'am. My name is Cindy, like I said. Okay, I am fine, Cindy. That's more like it. So tell me, are you free tomorrow night? Yeah, why? Well, I would love to invite you over for dinner. That's if you don't mind. No, no, I, I don't mind. I will actually uh, bring your portrait for you tomorrow morning. Just bring the portrait when you call me for dinner. <laughs> okay, sure. Sleep tight. 
we'll see tomorrow night. Good night. You know, she called me. Oh. Cindy. What did she tell you? Did she tell you she likes you? Likes me? Mm-hmm. She just invited me over for dinner. Wow. That's a big sign. Which sign? <laughs> it's a sign that she likes you. <laughs> what sure she likes me? Can you not jump into conclusion? I think I don't know. I know when a woman likes a man. I know. <laughs> you? Mm hmm You're only 15. Going to 16. So I know all those things. Do you realize you're talking to your father? Yes, ma. Let's go and prepare for the dinner. Uh, 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 no. I was invited, not us. We. Who is we? We, both of us. Who is speaking French here? <laughs> hey, hey. At least I'll eat good food tonight. Let's go. See, you see this granite? He must finish this granite. <laughs> no. <laughs> I am going to eat no. this food. I'll pour it then. Where? Here. Try me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going. Let's go. Mm. Mm. What are you doing here? Where's your father? He's paying the taxi driver. And um, Ma, let's get down with the dinner. Hi. Hi. Abigail, I told you to wait for me. I couldn't wait to. I was very hungry. Why are we standing? Let's be going to the dining. Um, I'm so sorry. She can be a handful sometimes. It's okay. Let's go. Okay. okay, we should. Okay. The restroom is by the left. This side? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> so, what about your wife? Won't she be upset that you're still out by this time? Um, she passed away. Oh. Yeah, she died eight years ago. Oh my so goodness. It's just my princess and I. I'm so sorry about the death of your wife. It's, it's okay. It's okay. <sighs> I've moved on, so I'm fine. Sorry to ask, what really happened to her? <sighs> she was ill. She died briefly after that. Oh. Too sad. I'm sorry. Okay. I see you really love your daughter a lot. Yes. She's my world. <laughs> Good. So, what about your thoughts about remarrying? I mean, sorry to pray into your private life. I mean, it's been eight years, like you said. Are you just going to keep your life on a hold because of your dead wife? Um, 
you're right. I I think I should move on, but I haven't met the right woman. See, the thing is, I don't want a woman to just love me, but also love my daughter. In fact, I will marry any woman my daughter wants me to. Are you trying to say your daughter has the final say in your life? Yeah, something like that. She's the boss. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> so, if any woman wants to get to you, they have to get through her. Mm hmm. She's the boss. Hmm. <laughs> nice. Um, what's keeping her? Is, is, is it the, the bathroom oh. that far? I'll go check her now. Okay. Let me see what she's up to. It's up. What do I have to do? There is no way I can please that little brat just because I want to get close to the father. <sighs> what do I have to do now? Send the tank. Hmm. I know exactly what to do. Why is she calling me at this time? Hello? Are you guys home already? Yes, um, we are home. Abigail is sleeping. That girl can talk. Yeah, I just, I just wanted to make sure you both arrived home safe and sound. Oh, that is so thoughtful of you. Thank you so much. Hmm, I can imagine. Will you be free tomorrow? Yeah, I'm free tomorrow. Okay, I want you to come over to my place tomorrow. I want you to draw me life. Can you do that? Yes, I can do that, but it will cost you. I'll pay you 500,000. You see? 500,000. 500, Is it too small? I can make it one million. Hey, is this not just a painting? Or uh, is she a painting, right? Or I'm painting Queen Elizabeth? <laughs> you're not just cute, but you're also a very funny man. Thank you. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> yes, uh, you see me. I'll be there. Um. Please come alone. I do not want you to come with your daughter. Why? Wherever I go, she goes with me. I just feel it will be a little bit awkward. Just don't bring her with you, please. Okay. All right, see you tomorrow. Do have a lovely night. Rest. Good night.
Let me see how you will escape me this time around. Abigail, your mama born you well. Abigail, Papa, yeah? are you going out? Yes, um, health service. My not tell me so I can get ready. Don't worry, not today. I know you like going out with me, but just stay at home and take care of the house. Why? Where are you going to? I'm going to see this house. And she insisted I come along. Hmm? Don't worry, I won't, I, I, I won't stay out too long. I'll be home soon. Eh? Take care of the household. Bye bye. Bye bye. You won't tell me anything. Bye bye. Is that what you're going to say? You tell me to take care. Abigail. Bye bye. The bedroom is nice. Thank you. Okay, um, so can we start? Yes, but let's make it straight. Oh, okay. Okay. We have all day to ourselves, so. Right. Just relax, feel comfortable. Okay. Thank you. Join you like this? No. Eminence, I'll be back. Okay. <laughs> so why are you angry? I thought this was what you wanted. She's a rich woman. 
And from what you told me, I think she likes your dad. That is it. You know, it has always been me and my daddy. Okay, yes, I know I wanted my daddy to marry a rich woman. But I think my daddy's attention will be divided. Okay, just take today as an example. He went out to that me. That is unlike him now. Don't, okay, okay, just imagine them being together, how it will look. Abigail, you know your dad loves you. He will always put you first. Yes, I know. I wanted a stepmother. But right now, I'm being skeptical about it. I don't know, I don't... So those things means. you were doing, you were just bluffing. Is that why you chased all the girls that approached him? You no, really don't want your dad to not remind like, you? Not like that. Hmm. I'm just having these feelings that my dad will, you know, you don't understand. Abigail, let your daddy remarry. Is he you your don't daddy? want to mother. Is he your daddy? Hmm. Sorry, yo. I don't okay. understand somebody. You like what you see? Mm -hmm. Ah, S sorry. We barely know each other. If my daughter finds this happens, she's not going to be happy. Are you going to tell her? I don't hide anything from her. She's my best friend. <sighs> okay. Can we just continue with, with the artwork, please? You, you know what? Just go. We'll do it some other time. Are you sure? Ah, uh, yeah. Don't worry. I'll pay for your time. Uh, okay. If you say so.
Bye bye. You would say. Daddy? My princess. Are you okay? Yes. I'm fine. Are you sure? Don't be like this is your tongue. Um Daddy did something wrong today. I broke the promise I made to your mommy. So what did you do? I promised your mother I will never be close to a woman like I did with Cindy today. Do you like her? Well, she seems like a nice person. <sighs> what is it? Why is your face like that? I thought that was what you wanted. Mm, yes. Well, I can't imagine someone else in the picture. She won't have my time anymore. That is not possible. You are my princess. Look, whatever happened today was a mistake, and I promise you it will stay that way, okay? Okay. So let's go inside. Your wish is my command. Let's go. Have you eaten anything? Ah, uh, I'm not hungry. Why? Because I had apple. You know, the only way you can get him is through his daughter. Those two, they are like five and six. Yeah. So, once, once you become friends with the daughter, just forget it. He's automatically yours. I just don't like that small thing. She talks way too much. It's just something about her that irritates my soul. Well, I, I don't think so. I think she's really a nice girl. Yeah. All you just need to do is become friends with her. Tell her how much you care about her father. You know, you know, girls, they don't like someone else coming in to share their father's love. You know how this works. Anyway, she's just a child. When Cindy wants something, she gets it. I'll call you. Thank you. All right.
Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Well, I'm okay. I am just missing you a lot. I miss your kisses. Look, um, Cindy, whatever happened shouldn't have happened. It was a mistake. Can you come to my house tomorrow? Look, I promise I won't do anything this time around. I just want us to talk. Please. Okay. Bye. Did you want us to talk about? Actually, I would just go straight to the point. Nestor, you are a very cute man. <clears throat> I have never felt this attracted to any man like I, I feel towards you. I really like you. In fact, I am in love with you. Please, give us a chance. I don't mind you having a daughter. I really don't mind. I promise, I will take her like she's mine. Um, Cindy, look. <sighs> Nestor. I have been thinking about you lately. I just cannot get you off my head. I promise I will change your life and your daughter's. I will take her to the best school in Nigeria. Really? Please. You'll do that for my daughter? And even more. Wow. So, what's your answer? My, oh. <sighs> um. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
Daddy. Good evening. Where have you been? Why are you still awake? Huh? You left this morning. You didn't tell me where you went to. Don't tell me you're worried about me. I was. I've been looking for you. Where did you go to? Um. Look, I have something to tell you. Come. You know, I love you so much. And you'll always be my baby girl. My princess. I know, and I love you too. Okay, um... Cindy and I... Like, we're together. But she loves me. And she cares about you too. That is what is important. Look, she has promised never to come between us. And she wants to take good care of you. Let's give her a chance. Do you love her? I pray she doesn't come between us. No, ah, she can't too. You know nobody can come between us. If they try it. That's why you left without telling me. I'm sorry now. Hmm? Smile. Hey. It's your mouth that is like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, yeah? It's okay. Have you eaten? Yes. What did you eat? Rice. Rice with what? Stew. I hope you've not finished that rice in that pot. No, I left your stew. Uh huh. Yes, I'll be free tomorrow. Okay, I will come pick you up by 1 p.m. Okay. Uh, Abigail is coming with us, right? No, it's just the two of us. Maybe some other time. Okay, no problem. So, I will see you tomorrow then? Yes. Alright, good night. I love you so much. <laughs> good night, I love you too.
Angel, just calm down. You don't understand. I can feel it already. She's going to snatch my father from me. Okay. Don't, you know what I'm saying? For the past few days now, the both of them have been together. And my dad doesn't want here to take me along with him. Guys don't like him now. He barely even spent time with me. I'm, I'm getting too scared. Okay, what if, what if she snatches him from me? What will I do? You're just being paranoid over nothing. She's your father's girlfriend. So they have to spend time together. Then me, I'm now what? Am I not his daughter? And you have to also spend time with me too. Happy girl, you worry too much. The relationship is still fresh, so just give them time, okay? Time, right? I'll give them time. Later. Look at her. Small madam. Small pepe. So only you want to have your dad's love. You can't share. Why would I share? You share your own daddy's love. Eh? Yeah. Okay. So what do you both have to say? Um, my princess, Auntie Cindy and I have, um, we have decided to get married. So? Not like I still have a say in your life anymore. My opinion doesn't count. Come on, princess. Do not speak like that. Your opinion matters to us. That is why we're coming to you. That is why we're telling you this. Sorry. I wasn't talking to you, please. Abigail, you don't have to be disrespectful. Okay, fine. Can you take me back home? Okay. Um, baby, let me drop her off. I'll be back, okay? Hi, Abigail. Um, can I? Can I use your car? Of course. Okay. You don't have to ask. Alright, okay. Thank you. I, I will get the keys. Abigail! Oh. <sighs> Don't worry. When I take control of your father, I will put you in your place. You little thing. But I was watching a movie. Am I the one you're speaking to? Abigail, you stupid! Do you realize that you are in my house? No, 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 does this place look like your father's house? Okay, get out. Get out before I squeeze you into my hands! Little brat! It's yours. Can you imagine? You want to give me command in my house? 
It's not your fault. Screaming. Just, just, just take a look. I remember telling this girl to do the dishes. Abigail! Abigail! What's that? Abigail, what's the meaning of this? What are these things still doing in my kitchen? I thought I told you to clean this up. Why haven't you washed the dishes? And the scene is very angry at you. I'm, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll wash it up. Sorry for yourself. You better clean this up. I don't want to return and see this, these things in my kitchen. Nessa, what are you still doing there? I'm coming. I want to check on Abigail. Don't disturb her, she's sleeping already. Okay, can I use the bathroom? Sure. <sighs> Hurry. Okay. <laughs> What do you want? I want to talk with my daddy. Are you blind? Can't you see his lids? Nestor, my husband is sleeping, so leave. <laughs> Get out. How to get something. Oh. I thought Dad promised me he would never let anyone come in between us. He barely even have time for me. We barely see each other even if we're in the same house. I am so disappointed in you, Daddy. Come in! What's keeping him? Are you putting makeup on? Oh, I don't understand why man should. Uh, yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I was just in the bathroom. Let's go, please. Please wait. What is it? I need to talk with you. 
I promise I won't take your time. Okay, hurry up because we're late. Can we go? There's no time. Let's go. You can talk to her much later in the day. Let's go. Okay, princess, we're rushing somewhere. When I get Letter, back, let's go. We'll talk about it, okay? All right? Sorry. Big girl. Okay. What are you doing here? Why are you standing outside? Why are you standing here? I've been waiting for you guys. You promise you talk to me when you're back. I know, but right now I am so exhausted. What part of he's exhausted don't you understand? My princess, I will come to your room later, alright? I said I'll come to your room later, I'm tired. Remember, he's my father, and you can't keep him away from me. <sighs> Sorry, remind me. Who is it to me? No, no, no. You just tell me. Who is it to me? Your husband. Good. You are intelligent. So basically, I have all the rights to him. You are just his daughter, and I am his wife. Have you forgotten it has always been both of us? That doesn't count. You can't just come into our lives and snatch my happiness away from me. I will not share my husband with anyone. And definitely not with you, you little thing. He is my husband. I should have the final say in his life and not you. 
So if you know what is good for you, stay away from him. Don't go too close. Now this is not what you promised. You promised never to come in between us. You promised to always love me. Newsflash, you have been fooled. The truth is, I hate you. And if I have my way, you will not be in this house. Get out. Bounce! You little creature. Good morning, baby. How are you? I'm fine. I waited for you last night, but I didn't come as promised. Oh, yes. Um, my princess, I am so sorry. Auntie Cindy was not feeling well and I had to take care of her. But I'm here now. What do you want to talk about? Don't I matter to you again? Of course you do. You are my princess. I don't think so. Because all you care about now is Auntie Cindy. That's not true. I care about you too. Daddy, you promised that you will never let anyone come between us. You promised to always put me first. But you don't even spend time with me again. <sighs> Baby, I am sorry. Daddy has been very busy. You know, I have a new job and there's a lot I need to learn about the company. I don't want to let Auntie Cindy down. You can't even make a statement without mentioning her name. Does my opinion still matter to you? Have I ever disregarded your opinion? Daddy, please can we go back to our house? Please. Your wife hates me. She doesn't want me here. And I don't want her to, to take you away from me. Nobody is taking me away. Auntie Cindy loves you. She cares for you. I to see the way she treats me. She doesn't want me here. Please. I can't. She's my wife. And this is our home. We have this beautiful roof over our heads. I have a new job, a new car. And you want us to live this luxurious life and go back to suffering? We can't do that. I thought that is what you have always prayed for us. This is not what I want. I just want, just you and I alone. I don't want any other person in the picture. Just you and I. I'm sorry, but we can't do that. We are not leaving. You hear me? Auntie Cindy is my wife and your stepmother. I don't want you to talk about this again. Come here. I love you so much. All right? Hmm? We'll be fine, okay? Can I get back to work? Hey, my love. What's up? What's wrong? What's the problem? You're my problem. Me? Your problem? What have I done? 
I don't like the way you are too lenient with your daughter. For goodness sake, you're a father. You should bring her up properly. I don't understand. You're the reason Abigail has no respect for anyone. She talks to me the way she wants. She has no drop of respect for me. Babe, if you continue to let her have her way all the time, you will end up spoiling her. She controls you like you are a toy. I don't like it. I'm just wondering if you would even love my child when he comes. Of course I'm going to love you. Wait. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Are you pregnant? <laughs> yes. You're pregnant? I'm two months gone. <laughs> Baby, you, you, what? <laughs> Wait, you, you have a baby growing inside of you? And I believe it's a boy. I am going to be a father for the second time. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, baby! Thank you! That is why I want you to step up your father game. Your prince is coming, son. My prince is coming. <laughs> and the princess is here already. <laughs> yes! <laughs> baby! <laughs> this is the best news ever! I am the man! I am the man! <laughs> Babe, what is it? Why are you sniffing around? I, I, I don't know. What is this smell? What smell? <coughs> Babe, can you stop? What, what is it? It smells like a dead meat. What is this? Dead meat. Babe, did you fart? Why would I do that? What's wrong with you? Abigail, did you? I didn't. Why are you asking me? <coughs> What? Sorry, what sorry. Is it? Baby, I'm not smelling. Just Can you stay put? Stay put. Stay put for what? I'm not smelling. Stop! No, you. Goodness. The smell is so bad. Excuse me. Hey! Just smell him! Hey! Abigail, hey. why do you smell like this? I, I, I don't understand. How is she smelling, baby? Just smell him! Hey! Hey! Baby, she's not smelling. I said she's smelling, Abigail. Why are you smelling like a dead meat? She, she's not smelling. What, what do you mean she's smelling? She's not smelling. Listen, what are you talking about? I said your daughter is smelling. Dad, are you being serious right now? Please, can you just tell her to leave? You know my condition. Offensive smell is not good for my health. Hey, um, Abigail, please excuse us. Just go! Really? I said excuse us. Just go. The smell is just too bad. Why is your daughter sleeping like this? Why is your daughter smelling like this? Where's the head fresh now? Better. That is good. Nesta, you did well. This is more like it. Keep being a man like this. Else you will just end up spoiling this young girl. Baby, I am working, okay? You're distracting me. My popcorn. Popcorn. Do you care for some? It's really tasty. Thank you. No, no, no. I have to feed you. While you walk. <laughs> Open your mouth. 
open your mouth, really. It's not, are you feeding me or not? Because. Uh, okay. Are you okay? Yeah, unless it's okay. Let's pray. Sure. <clears throat> oh Lord, thank you for this meal. Provide for those who doesn't have. Sanctify this meal with your blood. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. <sighs> Why is the food so salty? Salty? No, it's not. Ah! Taste your food. Ah! Oh, you're doing. Ah! Ah! Is that not salty? But I, I didn't. It wasn't like this when I left the kitchen. So you're trying to say that a ghost came into the kitchen and poured the whole container of salt in this food? Abigail, what kind of food is this? Abigail, you finish this food. You see these three plates? You will finish it. But it's salty! It's salt and so what? Who prepared it? Abigail, so this is your plan. You want to kill my baby with salt? Um, baby. No, she did it on purpose. N nothing is going to happen to this baby, okay? Finish this food. Why are you just so wicked towards me? Let's go. There's really no moment of rest for me in this house. I'm sorry. I just don't understand why your daughter hates me this much. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Eat that food. If I come back and this food... Shut up! Why are you also doing this?
Abigail, is this how to clean? Eh? Just keep it at the back of your mind that after doing this one, you will clean it all over again. Look at everywhere and say you're cleaning. Go and get some juice. Say okay, ma. Say it. Okay, ma. It's yours. If you like, sleep there. Don't come outside on time. I don't, know, I don't even know what you're doing in this house. So more, you cannot more. What is going on here? You're welcome. Why, why did you open the floor? I have told you countless times you can't be doing house chores. Your daughter will not lift a finger in this house. I cannot allow the whole place to be messed up. So I have to clean it myself. What do you mean she won't lift a finger? Where is she? Abigail! Abigail! Take juice to drink juice. Abigail, are you serious? Okay. But I was cleaning. You're cleaning what? Shut up! When I'm talking, you don't talk. Be very, very careful. Abigail is not afraid of anybody in this house. She doesn't listen. Maybe she will change much later. I don't know. In fact, no doubt. Ah, babe, it's okay. Stop it. Just let me deal with it. I said, no doubt! You see what you are lying off for your good father to do? You want to drink juice, Abby? Let me get my belt. I'll see how you continue to drink that juice. Okay, it's okay now. Just forgive. So, you wanted to, you wanted to, you wanted to call my name, Abby? You wanted to see? She will change. Hot. My baby is hot. But the air condition is on. It's not working. It's not working. My baby is going to die. My baby is not it's going to die. It's so hot inside. Okay, so do you want to go to the bathroom and have a cold shower? Mm -mm. That's not what the baby wants. So what do you want? This baby is going to die like this. He is not going to die. Just say what you want now. <laughs> the baby wants so hot to run him. At this time? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me look for something to find. No, 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 you does not want you. But it's just the two of us in this room. The baby said he does not want you. Oh, you spoke to the baby? The baby just spoke to me. Yeah. He said he wants someone else to find me. Okay, I asked the baby, who, who, which person is that? Who is that person? The baby said he wants his stepsister to find me. Stepsister? Okay, Abigail. Mm. Mm, they want to do bonding. They want to do... Oh. The baby said that to you. He just spoke to me now. The other day that the baby said he wants Papa, when he bought Papa for me, did I know he did and I was calm? Hey, go and call for me. I'm very, very old. I'm going to die you. This baby will die you. Go now. I'm going.
I did not say you should break my leg. What is wrong with you? Massage my, my feet. You're, you're pressing my, 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 my veins. Useless girl of a dead mother. Don't kill me and my baby. Massage my leg very well. Apply pressure. Apply pressure now. Ah, ah. Sorry. Don't annoy me. Oh. Press this thing very well. Ah. How do you want me to do it? Ah. Are you talking back at me? Abigail, are you, are you talking back at me? Sorry. See, you better respect yourself in this household so that they don't say that I am a wicked woman because I will kill you alive. No problem. If your father comes, I will tell him. You know what he will do to you. I don't need to tell you. Massage his leg. In fact, stand up, stand up, stand up! Go and get me juice. Look at juice here. Go and bring another one. I say, sorry. Evil child. I don't even know what I even want. My body's peppering. Abigail! Sorry. Just breathe, breathe, huh? We're almost there. We're almost there. It's coming up. Sorry, baby. Sorry. 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 Just breathe. Yes. Leave that wish. Let's go. Abigail, what is keeping you inside? Rub my back. Sorry, sorry. I'm rubbing it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Give me that back. Give it to me. Give it to me. Stay, stay back there. Come where? Sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. Hmm? Sorry. I'm rubbing it. I'm rubbing it. Sorry. Sorry. What are you waiting? I'm, I'm holding you. I'm holding you. Sorry. Just breathe. Breathe, eh? Breathe. Yes. Breathe. Almost there. Almost there. I'm sorry. 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 
hurt my leg, carry my leg, carry my leg. I, 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 it's carry your leg. How am I going to carry your leg when you're walking? all your support these past few months. You don't need to thank me. Why are we friends? Just ensure you take good care of yourself, okay? I will. I know it's not going to be easy now that your wife is not there. But just try. God knows the best. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Abigail. Please, take care of your father and your brother. This is the time they need you most. Okay? Okay. Uh, Amaka. Sir. I also want to thank you. You did an amazing job. If I need you in this house, I'll call you. Okay, sir. Thank you. Okay, Nesta, I should be on my way. I have somewhere to go. Okay. Going by what your mother did to me, I should be wicked to you. But I won't. You are my brother, my blood, a lovely soul, and you are innocent. Abigail! 
Abigail. Why are you shouting my name like that? Abigail, I'm pressed. The bathroom, you've locked the door. Is that, what, is that what you were shouting? Abigail, please stop, please. He's sorry, he's coming out, please. I cannot go, I'm busy with my brother. Ah, ah, Abigail, 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 please, 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 please. Just, just open it for me. He will start crying. Let me go and meet him. Just open it before you go now. Is it? Yeah. See, let me tell you, if you like, who here, we here, just have it in your mind that I will not clean this place. Ah, and I'm not the one that will help you. Please. Abigail, Abigail, Abigail! My brother is crying! Abigail, wait! Abigail, Abigail! 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 My princess. I'm not your princess. My father is not a king, so I am not a princess. Though my father was a king. But right now, my father is not a king. So you address me by my name. Abigail. My princess, please. It's been two days. You've been giving me pap. And I've been telling you to, to make swallow for me. Huh? I'm tired of eating pap. Can you just make swallow for me? Am I going to ask him for food now? So you, 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 know, you know who I am now? Wait first, let me understand something. You really want me to cook for you? Or is it the... The girl that you left your, your, your late wife to torture. Is she the one you want to you want her to go and make food for you? Please. Please what now? I'm very hungry. Hmm. You're hungry. And you want to swallow. Yes. I'm coming. Don't know that today. You will not eat anything. Abigail. Abigail. Princess, I am so sorry. I allowed my late wife to maltreat you. Forgive me. I know I have not been the best father this past few months. I broke the promise I made to you. And I understand why you're behaving this way. I don't deserve your forgiveness. But please, please find the place in your heart to forgive me. I'm not even supposed to be in this house anymore. Supposed to have left since a long time ago. But because of my brother, because of this boy here, I don't want him to carry the burden of his parents' mistakes. Because he is innocent.
me go. I am sorry. I am sorry. So? What do you mean, so? I can't eat this. So is that the reason you spat the food? Huh? Have you forgotten when you asked me, you forced me to eat three plates of salty food? Have you? Abigail, uh, please. I'm sorry. Eat this food. Else, don't be food again for you. In this house for one month. Ah. Uh. Yes. Abigail, Abigail, please now. I'm sorry. Enjoy your food. Ah, Abigail. Ah, Abigail. Ah, Abigail. Abigail. Ah. Ah. Oh. Abigail, oh, my tummy is hurting, please. I need help. Ah. Why are you shouting? Abigail, I need help, my stomach. Please, 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 come for help, please. Do you realize there's a baby in the house? Ah, Abigail, please. Ah. Abigail, Abigail, please. <coughs> please. Ah. I don't care if you still need ah. And please stop shouting. Oh. Amiga. Amiga. You will wake the baby. Please, please, Amiga, please, please. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Amiga. Amiga. Tell me. Amiga. Amiga. Ah! <laughs> 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 Your father called me on phone and he sounded so worried. Really? Yes. So what's the issue? What's the matter? I don't know. I should be asking you. Where is he? He's upstairs. Okay. <coughs> oh. 
Abigail, how come your father suddenly developed chronic ulcer? Haven't you been feeling him well? I don't know. Mikus, I have wronged my daughter. Please, talk to her and ask her to forgive me. You can never forget what you did to me. Nothing in this world will make me forget what you did to me. You hurt me. Nesta, how come your daughter became so cold towards you? I guess it is time for me to pay for my complacency. My child, I'm always here watching over you. I've missed you so much. I miss you too. Please, I want to go with you. I don't want to stay with daddy anymore. He doesn't love me again. No, my child. My princess, daddy is truly sorry for hurting you. And you know he's the only one you have now. Please. I cannot forget what he did to me. I cannot forgive him. Please, my princess. For mommy's sake. Daddy loves and cares for you. Please forgive him. Please. Please, my baby, please. Forgive daddy. Forgive daddy. My baby, please forgive daddy. treated her wrongly and I neglected her. Please forgive me. I am truly sorry. Daddy. Abigail. Daddy. Daddy. My princess. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything I did. No, no, no. My princess, she didn't do anything wrong. I am sorry. Please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I forgive you. You forgive me?
Hey, where are you going? Huh? Come here. I love you. <laughs>